Good morning all, I just wanted to show you the robot and how well it's done. Uh, we've done incredibly well with this new 2.1 logic and what it's doing, it's using the bubbles. We're waiting for the bubbles to go to their extremes and then we're fading that uh, extreme basically and then we're anticipating that the bubbles are then going to converge over time and it seems that it's working really really well. We've got a 71% hit rate which is fantastic. We made nearly 6% return on our account this week um, so that's worth noting so if we have like a, a somewhat poor week next week we should still be okay uh, but we're up a lot I'm very 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 happy we're putting so much work into this so just a short video today really just want to show you the robot I want to show you the spreadsheet and I'm going to show you the indices and gold so technical scores dumped so we're 12 out of 100 <laughs> we can see that we really fell VIX pumped like crazy uh, so um, got to be careful basically so normally I would be looking to buy the dips on the indices because we've got a low score but I'm actually really tired and a bit frazzled and so I'm going to be doing this bulletin and I'm going to take the I'm going to take the day off because this <laughs> basically uh, I can sort of sit on my laurels a little bit and think well all that hard work that I put in for the last few years basically it's coming to fruition and it's actually proven to be successful it's all down to the bubbles extreme reversal scenario so um so normally i would take a i would take a trade today based on the technical score i'm looking to buy a dip because that's green uh, admittedly this is a little bit red but uh so normally i would buy but i'm, I'm quite tired so just a quick video today i think uh, indices really fell like you saw QDB scores we are uh, EG at the top um, so that could probably do a bit better and we've got AC at the bottom and perhaps you could argue that could be a little bit worse so that's the spreadsheet I'll show you the um, gold and indices um, really happy with the robot by the way I just um, <laughs> putting so much work it's it's crazy uh, I don't know how many hundreds of hours maybe more probably a thousand hours um, but yeah we made a buy on gold so we should probably be coming up keep an eye on this doji here so perhaps above 1925 could be okay uh, but we get normally sort of get the doji sometimes at the crossover so if you want to go for a long wait for that to break okay uh, gold off we'll look at DAX they're going long on DAX, which is a bit bonkers, um, but we've fallen so much, um, perhaps a little bit of recompense, a little bit of a payday scenario. And I think this is possibly going to follow the US indices where we can see, I think they're going to be, will be by today. I would normally take it, but I'm going to be taking it easy, I think, today. I think um, I think it's deserved. I think oh, I'm quite tired. Wednesday was crazy and... Uh, we did really well out of the FOMC. So they're going long on DAX, so I, it might come up and they might get paid, but it, it probably shouldn't. But it might just be following the US uh, Dow Jones and the S&P, um, possibly, because these are probably going to be making a buy, I think, because we're going to get the crossover there. See, So if we, if we fall and we break this low, they're going to probably going to sell it and we're going to get the buy. So we might need to see a breach of this, okay? And um, USA, and then we'll just wrap up. Very quick video. And I'm here if you've got any questions, um, I'd like you guys to join uh, Patreon so you can test the robot. Uh, I think it will definitely be worth your while uh, getting on board because we've got a huge amount of stuff on offer, and you're getting a, an amazing robot as well in the in, in the deal. You know, as long as you do basic package then you get the QDB robot and you can see it's performing really well uh, potentially we're going to get a buy so a flush of those lows should probably cement the fear because it needs fear in order to drive the market and then, then we'll propel higher but we'll have resistance overhead so that's today's video and I wish you a great weekend I'll be back on Sunday for the cot data and then we'll be back to business on Monday and then we can reactivate the robot on Sunday night Monday and I'll speak to you guys soon